Okay, in this video, I'm just going to show you a high-resolution video animation of this scene in here. And really, most of the time I spent was just setting up the lighting and getting it the water effects to look right. And it's set pretty high, about 200. And the simulation itself didn't take that long. It was less than a half an hour. But the rendering, in this case, was several hours, about two and a half hours, because I had the uh, water, or I had the samples in the rendering to pass that up to 60 and that really helps otherwise if you don't have that up there at least that high then this water will start looking grainy and it really doesn't work that well all right so let's see what the animation looks like it's seven seconds and there are some anomalies in it I haven't figured that out yet but at least I have the lighting the way I want so then now if I build a city scene in here then I have my general lighting and everything already in place so let's see So here's the anomalies that I'm talking about right up in here. You see that with the mouse one there, one over here as well. I'm not sure what that's all about yet. But at this resolution, it worked good. And so, you know, for what I'm trying to do, I don't really need to set it at a much higher resolution, though it does even look better if you set it higher than this. But it works fine. But it really, a lot of it, for this really just comes down to your colors and your lighting to get the effect that you're looking for. Alright, and so I'll probably continue working on fluid stuff uh, through the end of the month. So keep an eye out for that, and I'll see you in the next video.